literally just went from idea to full-fledged business in a matter of 24 hours. Tiffany France did during this pandemic what many did not. She started the business she's been dreaming about for years. The reason why I'm surviving is because I was able to find an outlet. My husband has, has taken up running, so he's become a runner and I've become a business owner. That business? Cheese and Things. A curated charcuterie box hand-delivered to your door. The idea, an organic one that came by way of her big brother. My brother is a chef and I come from a large Jamaican family and so whenever um, we would have family gatherings, he would not let anyone in the kitchen. So the only thing that I was able to do was make the cheese board. By day, Tiffany cares for her two young kids and works as an HR manager. But she's also managed to fulfill 250 Cheese and Things boxes since May. Without the distraction of rushing to work, after school activities, the gym, errands, and all the other things that consumed her pre-COVID life, now she has time for the one thing that has the potential to change not only her future, but that of her kids. So ultimately, I would love to become like the edible arrangements of charcuterie. Um, they're great boxes to gift when you're, you know, thinking of gifting ideas. They're great boxes for, um, you know, sympathy, for well wishes, for congratulatory um, gifts. So that's really the plan. A black-owned Brooklyn business thriving at a time when small businesses are struggling to stay afloat. A business partnering with other small businesses like butchers, bakers, and fresh markets. Born not out of necessity, but rather a desire to share that which unites us all. A good meat and cheese board. Unless, of course, you're vegan. Teresa Priolo, Fox 5 News.